Technician tracking and scheduling with Windward System 5 can save you hours of time by not having to enter in information in multiple systems as well as providing a completely integrated solution for your business to quickly schedule your technicians. In this video we'll be covering off how you can quickly process an incoming phone call, easily view a technician's schedule, and even email emergency information fast after the end of the transaction so your technicians have it to be able to action. There is some optional hardware that we recommend for anyone doing uh, management of multiple technicians or vans and that is specifically dual monitors that allows you to have lots of desktop space and be able to see the information presented on the screen and optionally even a barcode scanner where your invoices can have a, a barcode to be able to quickly bring up transactions and it can act as a time saver in, in respect to just getting the, the business processes completed. What that's going to look like in Windward System 5 is the phone's going to ring and typically you're going to be starting out with just a new sale and we're going to start this out as a work order for uh, Mary Smith and uh, she's a member of our preferred customer club. We've had a warning comment uh, presenting that information at this point and you obviously might want to use just our standard uh, our standard comments which you can pre-configure and that allows you to just have a, a a predefined drop down to be able to facilitate a fast uh, check in, uh, whether it be phone based or someone dropping off something, and that makes it easy. So, if we've got a pump not working uh, with Mary and uh, it makes a ticking noise, we can go ahead and type in any other additional information that she's going to provide for us to, to make that possible. Now, at this point, for booking and just checking our technicians' availability, we can choose to head out to our, uh, out to our deliveries, and that's going to be presenting information. So, in this example, uh, in our trial version here, we've got a, a couple or five appointments, that's what that's showing, two in the morning, three in the afternoon. And I can go ahead and drill into that list to be able to see the technicians that I've, I've got currently enabled in the system. We also support colors, so if you did want to uh, use the color red as an emergency as an example, and this makes it really easy to be able to see uh, holes in a day for a technician to be able to service something. So in this example, I might just want to choose this one o'clock uh, appointment window and I'll go ahead and select the, this work order for Mary. And that's going to pop up and allow me to just type in any additional information that we want to communicate to the technician. And that might uh, be to uh, you know, watch out for the dog, white picket fence, whatever uh, relevant information for even finding the property or where the call is to be able to, to schedule that. And if we're using any colors, we can go ahead and, uh, and associate that at that point uh, in, in the process. So that's gonna drop onto our appointment calendar and just make it really easy to even do drag and drops between the, uh, the scheduling as well for the technicians themselves. Going back to our work order uh, at this point uh, for a pump not working, if there's a minimum check-in service, that can be done. And even the delivery information can be accessed from here as well. So it's really your 360 degree view of that work order and just uh, managing that process. Now for communicating that information to our technician, we do have the ability to email that transaction. So in the case of an emergency, it may make sense to go ahead and fire that off. So emailing a, a, just a PDF version of the invoice itself. That can be hotkeyed for just being on the bottom of the invoice as well to make it a simple click to be able to generate that information. And any email information that's going to be entered in on the customer record will flow through to the email screen just to give you an idea of what, uh, what that potentially can look like. Our PDFing engine is built into Windward System 5, so that doesn't mean you have to go out and purchase any additional technology that's bundled in. So just a sample work order, our uh, scheduled for information is available with our technician date and time. And that would be going through to his smartphone uh, to be able to review that information and just be able to action it as to what makes sense as the next scheduled call. Also for just scheduling in general, there, may be some, there might be some geography involved where you're gonna be taking a look at your scheduling. This is our task book, so certainly in a, you know, where are the holes? Uh, if you wanted to look at your task list and be able to just take a look at uh, possible locations and where a driver is, if there's any geography for quadrants in your city or just being making it easy to, to just schedule your technician uh, around a given ge geographic area that's uh, available to quickly see that information by city as well as address information. I trust that that sheds some light on some of the questions around technician scheduling in Windward System 5 and really shows you how you can save some time, money, and improve your customer service. If you have any further questions or concerns, contact your sales representative. And remember, at Windward Software, we help you run your business instead of just reporting on it.